Hi, in this video, we're going to find the limit as p approaches 2 of 3p divided by the square root of 4p plus 1 minus 1. Let's go ahead and work through it very carefully. So recall that the first thing you should always try to do when computing limits is plug in the number. If you can plug in the number and it makes sense, you're done. So let's try to do that and see if it works. So basically, we're going to take this 2 and put it everywhere we see a p. And when we do that, we drop the limit sign. So 3 times 2 divided by, then here we have the square root of 4 times 2 plus 1. And then here we have the minus 1. This is equal to 3 times 2 is 6 divided by, here we get 4 times 2, which is 8. 8 plus 1 is 9, so this is the square root of 9 minus 1. So this is 6 over the square root of 9 is 3, so we get 3 minus 1. So that's going to be 6 over 2, which is equal to 3. So we got an answer, so we're done. So if we hadn't gotten an answer, then we would have had to try something else. So again, as a general rule, when you're computing limits, just take whatever's here and plug it in. If you can get a real number as an answer, you're good. If you don't get a real number, then that's where you have to try something else. Good luck.